right there, Latin one. Here we go, review 3G. Go ahead and translate, I'll wait. Okay, you've translated. Uh, so here we go. Um, be careful of tense, get out your red pen, correct things as you go. There's nothing wrong with correcting mistakes. There's something wrong with trying to hide mistakes. So when Tullus Hostilius, the third king, was ruling the Romans, the Romans were fighting with the citizens of Alba Longa, of a city which was not far away. In fact, I know exactly how not far away, it was like 12 miles. And last year, I spent the night on the other side of the mountain from when they actually had this battle. Um, ah, yes. Um, however, uh, they, uh, neither the Romans nor the Albans were wanting to fight. Uh, for many Romans uh, were having either friends or relatives in the city Alba Longa. And so the Romans seize, uh, were, the Romans seize a plan and they send uh, messengers to the Albans. The messengers say, uh, it is not necessary for all the Romans to fight with all the Albans. We have amongst our soldiers triplet brothers by name Horatii, or name the Horatii. Y'all have amongst y'alls uh, triplet brothers uh, named the Curiatii. If y'all want, these brothers uh, will fight with those brothers with those. And the victors uh, will of the battle um, will bring back the victory of the war on behalf of his nation, or on behalf of his, his country, his people, his homeland. This plan pleases the Albans. The brothers hurry into the war, or into battle. They fight fierce, the Horati and Kurati fight fiercely. Um, one from the Kuratii receives a wound then another, then a third. Uh, however, the Curiatii kill two from the Horatii. One Horatius stands uh, against three wounded Curiatii, alone but unhurt. Horatius, however, uh, does not fear, and, but he seizes a plan. Horatius already runs from that spot, and he flees from the Curiatii. The Kuratii seek the Horatius, but uh, because they are wounded, they run with large intervals in between. And so when one from the one Kuratius uh, goes past his brothers, Horatius turns himself and he kills him, the Kuratii. Again, Horatius flees. Again, he turns himself and he kills uh, one from the Kuratii. In this way, all three, uh, he kills all three Curiatii, or Horatius. Uh, one Horatius kills all three uh, Curiatii. The victor is Horatius, and he has the, uh, and the Romans have the victory of the war. So what I want you to do is answer all those questions uh, in Latin. Okay, so write out the question, then answer it. Then I want you to go ahead and do review 3H and go back and do 3F. 3H is pretty easy, find all those things. Uh, and then go back and do 3F, um, which is um, just, uh, easy, okay? So uh, write out Fortasse Fratre. Actually, you know what? Yeah, write out Fortasse Fratre Saipe Sorore and then highlight which ones are adverbs and only, mo er, and only uh, translate those. Okay, so you'd highlight Fortasse, you'd hi highlight Saipe. The other ones you wouldn't. And you would uh, say that Fortasse means perhaps and Saipe means often. Okay. Now, uh, the next video, I'm going to just indulge myself a little bit because there's something really cool that happens there on line six. Well, actually lines uh, six, seven, and eight that I really like. And then also something that happens on lines 19 and 20. So the next video you're going to see is probably more enrichment than anything else, but it's one of the reasons that I love Latin. All right, I'm going to hit the button.